Okay guys, so today's video I'm gonna share with you is we're going to use this one of our EA or expert advisor using this news right now in uh, Canadian uh, dollar, right? So there's a big news for Canadian dollar, uh, BOC rate statement. So it happens on 11 p.m. here in uh, Asian time in uh, U.S. is about 11 a.m., right? So it has two news, BOC rate and uh, overnight rate for Canadian and then for US dollar it has an ISM non manufacturing beam use this our EA here but to our MP4 so we're gonna use this EA pips plus price action EA to capture the trading news right so right now I'm going to upload this to my USD Canada so we choose the USD Canada here so if you are not aware so this is a USD Canada pairs right I already have here so what I do now is I will just um, drug my EA in this currency pair and then I already have set up previously so I have a set file so I just loaded that USD Canada set file so I'll share with you what is the set file so as you can see here 1658 I already put in is because of the time at 11 p.m. is equivalent to 16 uh, about 16 1700s right so but now it's almost time so in the hundred so I put it 1658 the a will open up or the expert advisor this particular uh, expert advisor uh, pips plus price action e 2.2 where this is a new version right it's a full of uh, setup whereby it's a very safe a right so 1658 and 702 right so almost that almost happens right so I will put the set uh, gap and low about 10 pips each then uh, expired PO and then lot size about one, one lot so it's equivalent to $10 each pip so I'm going to lose about uh, this is a very risky so don't uh, follow this as a risky setup right so if your account is not big enough so don't use this lot size you can change that to, to point zero one if your lots uh, if your amount is uh, below 1000 or you can choose it's about 0.1 right so, so 0.1 means if <coughs> you're putting stop loss here 1000 and then you want 0.1 here so if you are using five digits that's equivalent to hundred dollars right loss but if you are uh, win as well you are having two hundred dollars but I'm putting here is a one dollar uh, one uh, one lots all right and then margin level management we're going to control that uh below 2000 i won't open any trade anymore right and then um max spread pips three and slippage at one and then i just leave it this one this is a false i don't want to um close the trade after the next day right so next is the trailings start so i want to put aside from i have a take profit here i wanted to use the trailing start and trailing stops and trailing steps so it's it's let's say the moment that i reach 10 pips so i will start a trailing so it means i will lock the profit and then and i will lock at 10 pips as well if uh, the market reverse so i just earning with zero and i also lo lost with zero the moment i lost uh, the moment i reach the target right so that's the steps so, so 10 pips okay so um i'll click okay and then uh, right here so you can see that it's already here 1658 and that's the time now is about uh, yeah about uh, 10 minutes more to go nine minutes more to go before that uh, trade is opening so as you can see here because this account I also running this in my BPS uh, server so in my BPS server there is uh, some other pairs that I also use with a uh, with a smaller size right this is how the 24 hours running right but i want to trade using this account as well with a specific um timing a specific time with the usd canada all right so what's up guys uh wait for it what we're going to happen whether the um the market either we shoot up or shooting down all right as you can see here guys so now it's 16.58 and one minute more to go is 16 57 is almost the same time and then uh, the 
EA will open up a trade or buy one a buy stop and uh, sell stop one each all right I'm gonna wait for that and then uh, see how the market goes okay guys as you can see that it's already earning at the uh, it hits our one of our buy stops order you see it's already 146 US dollars right so that's how it works also you can see the trailing is also moving up now to higher right so that's how it works right so the market is uh, coming back and it closed so it closed with uh, 16 dollars so it's, it's good enough right so that's for tonight